So my good friend Ollie, or 8-Bit Boy UK, as most of you guys might know him, well, he thinks the Master System's a bit of a challenge. And it's about time I took one of these challenges, and I'm going to start with Teddy Boy. Okay, so let's just get straight on to the gameplay, and this is only the second time I've done the Master System Challenge for Ollie. And Teddy Boy can't be that hard, can it? I mean, look, little cutesy platformer, let's get cracking. Three lives, standard fare. Right, so we've got dice, and... Oh, it's wrestlers, like Mexican wrestlers. Right, and I think I'm shooting their eyeballs out. I mean, that's kind of what it looks like to me. I'm shooting their eyeballs out and shooting some big ice cubes. So, now I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do. Obviously, maybe collect eyeballs. No, yes, maybe. Yeah, collect eyeballs. That seems fairly straightforward, and that's, well, you know what, I can live with that. So, 13,000 points. Right, and what's with the dice? What, what are these things? Right, they've got red eyeballs, obviously, because they're red things. There's no crouch, that's quite annoying. Oh, 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 how far down can I go before I fall? And why did an eyeball just attack me there? And there's, like, a beetle. And a snail. How very... Master System. Oh, there's the first death, and yeah, we've got a little ghost animation. Always fun. Here we go. Right, so I'm still on the same level, that's good, right? Do I have to kill these snails? They're not beetles, they're snails. Nope, I just stop them. I don't know if that helps at all, stopping these snails. Now, of course, snails, if you're a Master System fan, you'll know snail is quite an important little creature. And I'm going down quite far, so I don't know whether it just scrolls back in on itself or not. What is this up here? It's like, ah, it's the eyeballs. Now, I think that took some sort of TM bar off there at the bottom. Right. So... Right, no, 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 don't want to hit the snails because they'll probably kill me. I have no idea what I'm supposed to be doing here. And the snail in the shell just takes you out. Man, that's just ridiculous. Right, okay, one life to go. Ah, snails. Right, I don't know what I managed to do there. I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing here. Do I collect that? Right, I collect that little thing. But how did I kill that snail? Answers in the comments, please. What else have we got? Come on. Right, so, um, there's another one of those, I'm assuming, dead snails. Ah, and there's another snail. Right, okay, so the snails are quite tough. I'm going to give this another run because, well, it's the first time I played the game and I didn't do too badly, I don't think, for the first time. So, now I've got a better idea of what I'm doing. I'm shooting the Mexican wrestlers, collecting their eyeballs. Before their eyeballs do something, uh, attack me. No, take down that power bar, which is really weird. It's a, an, in, an interesting mechanic, I'll say that, at least. And I think... No. I should stop thinking. should maybe stop talking. So the mechanic seems to be that if you shoot the enemy, their eyeball drops out and if you don't get it in time, it goes down and takes something off this TM bar. Interesting. I mean, if you know more about this game than me, why don't you just let me know? Oh, that was just a stupid place to go. Oh, wait a minute. Right, they've got little moustaches. 
I'm going to, I'm definitely going to zoom in there and have a proper look at those guys because, you know, video editing is wonderful. Right, get all these eyeballs before they kill my TM and kill these mustachioed guys. Obviously doing Movember, a bit like Paul the Retrobait. Right, we're back to these snails and these snails are quite annoying. I don't know how I, right, I think you can kill them by shooting them head on. So, let's just take a gander at that. Yeah, shoot the eyeballs, get the snails. Otherwise they just crawl in. Oh, and there's these mustachioed guys again. They're definitely little guys with mustaches. Uh, maybe kinda dig it, Mario. I don't think I'm getting through this level, guys, but you know what? It's, it's a bit of fun, and then I might even give it some more time after this game. Right, I need to get rid of those bouncing Marios. No, no! Get rid of the bouncing Marios. Well, is that it? Is that game over? It is, and the score is 24,020. Round 2. You know what? It wasn't too bad, so let's go back to the outro. So there you go my friends, that was Teddy Boy on the Master System and this week's Master System Challenge from 8 Boy UK. Now was it a challenge? Well it certainly was a challenge for me and let's face it, I'm more of a JRPG guy and I'm maybe just a, a tad bit out of practice when it comes to the platformers. It was a fun little experience and I'll certainly be going back to play some more. Now of course if you've enjoyed this video why don't you hit me with a thumbs up because one, it makes me feel good and two, you know, it helps the channel too. But also of course being 8 Boy UK's Master System Challenge, I want you to drop down into the comments where I'll leave a link to his channel and maybe try it out for yourself or check out the other guys who have taken part in this wonderful challenge. I will be trying to do these weekly, I don't know if I'll be able to, but if I can, I certainly will be trying to get on board with the Master System Challenge. It's something I've been trying to get involved with for quite a while now. So thank you very much for watching as always and until next time, cheerio!